I am just outside Copenhagen, Denmark, where I live. And as you can see right behind me here, we have a beautiful sunset. But if you take a quick look at my watch, you will see that it's currently 20 minutes to 10. So 9.40 p.m. And I actually still have about 20 minutes of daylight left before the sun sets. And this is going to pose a number of unique challenges for me as an astrophotographer when I live this far north. If you take my book, The Cosmic Field Guide, and you flip it up to page 25, you will see that here I have put in the four levels of darkness that we work with in astrophotography. Civil darkness right after sunset, then we have nautical darkness, astronomical darkness, and night. And it's during the astronomical darkness where we can usually begin to take our astro images. Because I'm about 55 degrees north, which is further north than most people in Canada, I have a bit of an issue. In the book, I have what's called darkness plots. I have it here for 50 degrees and for 60 degrees north. And what these plots shows is how many minutes, I have minutes out here, after sunset, do we get civil twilight in the light, and we have nautical in the slightly darker, astro darkness, and then the black one is full on night. As you can see here, we look at these two. I'm right in between these two. So here in the summer, we have no astronomical night, and we have no astronomical darkness either for a long period of time. What is an astrophotographer to do if you have long periods of time where you can't image, either due to bad weather, or in my case, because it's just too light and we don't get enough darkness?